Hey guys, welcome into this short little video that I'm going to create for you guys. And the reason why I'm actually creating this video is because Trucker Jukebox told me something uh, earlier that was very disturbing to me. And I know this goes on sometimes out here in the trucking industry, but uh, I figured I would do uh, a safety video about us truckers here on the road and uh, figured maybe talk a little bit on uh, some of the things that are going on in the, in the trucking industry, you know, on things you can do and uh, basically talk about safety. So what he told me there earlier said uh, one of his friends at his company got killed uh, last night because of some people just in a need for a little bit of something money or whatever or maybe they're doing drugs or I don't know exactly what they are doing but they just felt the need to uh, rob this uh, trucker and that goes on a lot out here and they actually came up and knocked on his door and or climbed on his uh, side of the truck and uh, he went to go open his window a little bit to see what's going on and the uh, guy pulled a gun on him and shot him plank, bang, uh, uh, point blank. I was looking for the word. Sometimes I lose the English words but and literally killed him and they stole everything out of his truck. I mean, for what? You know? He had a, had a wife and uh, I believe it was two kids that Chupac said that he had and uh, no they're not going to see a dad at home my no? prayers go out to you tonight for you that lost your uh, loved one this last night and we will keep you in our prayers i know i don't personally know you but trucker jukebox knows you and uh, i figured he is uh, very hurt and uh, everything, so I would uh, make this video and uh, instead of him, because he's uh, he's very hurt by his loss as well. And uh, we will keep you guys in mind and our prayers and our hearts. And uh, we uh, we love all of you guys out here, no matter who you are. What I wanted to talk about is. Some of the things that you can uh, try to prevent these things from happening. And one of the things is make sure you park at a uh, good truck stop that possibly has security in the, in the lot. I know a lot of these bigger truck stops, they do have that nowadays. I know it's not always possible to do that, but uh, also try to uh, park in a very well lit up area uh, that has a lot of lights i know sometimes some people say it's annoying to them they can't sleep like that but uh, generally i can close my curtain pretty good and uh, you get used to it after a while and uh, some of the other things that you can uh, you can do is uh, when you are inside a truck stop and especially if you are taking a cash advance I know some of us we out here we do take a cash advance be aware of your surroundings uh, I see this so often and I'm even guilty of doing this myself walking back from the truck stop into my truck just took a cash advance and I'm looking at my phone checking all out the emails or Facebook or Twitter or whatever you guys are doing too and you're not paying attention to what your surrounding is that would be a very big uh, thing to keep eye, uh, keep an eye on that you're not being followed. And if you are, try to make, make some sudden moves or don't, uh, don't try to walk back to your truck. Try to make a, a turn somewhere so you can start walking back towards the truck stop and let them know that something is not right or call 911, you know, get help out there. And if you uh, are a woman, a lot of times if it's dark at night uh, try to park at a truck stop that has a uh, security there and if you are scared to walk back to your truck when it's dark get the security guy to uh, 
escort you back to your truck and make sure that you guys are safe out there and I've also heard uh, some things that uh, some of these people will try to just rob you as they will get a woman to knock on your door and ask for money or anything like that and as soon as you open the door or open the window wide enough a guy comes from behind or whatever out of the nowhere and tries to uh, pull a knife on you or or a gun uh, just be vigilant keep an eye on that mirror to, to look in the mirror don't keep your eyes on that woman she might be beautiful and it might attract you guys and just be careful when you are at, at places like that just you know like at truck stops uh, be very aware of what's going on in the surrounding areas but uh, anyways I am a dad as well and I want to come home to my family and so do you I'm sure a lot of you especially for women out there uh, family is is extremely important to you as much as it is to me although we men we don't tend to show it as much as women do but we do care about our families and I certainly do want to come home to my family I love them very much and I'm sure that all of you love your family very much so uh, with that we are going to wrap up this little video and uh, be safe out there uh, share this video with as, as many friends as you possibly can and uh, get the word out there uh, you know these things do happen uh, be vigilant that's that's my number one thing be vigilant be aware of your surroundings so anyways we are out of here trucker Rudy is signing out and we will see you on the next one have a good one